the extracellular thyroxine or T4 and triiodothyronine or T3 enter a cell by carrier mediated ATP dependent transport process. In the cytosol of the cell, there are three types of iodinase enzymes. They are D1, D2 and D3. Out of these three enzymes, only D1 and D2 deiodinize T4 to form T3. The T3s then enter into the nucleus. In the nucleus, the gene has a thyroid hormone response element. To this thyroid hormone response element, a heterodimer containing an inactive thyroid hormone receptor and a RXR is bound. T3 then binds to the inactive thyroid hormone receptor. Due to this binding, the inactive thyroid hormone receptor becomes active. It was found that more than 90% of the thyroid hormone molecules that bind with the thyroid hormone receptor is T3. The active thyroid hormone receptor then initiates transcription. The transcription produces large number of different types of mRNAs. The mRNAs then moves out of the nucleus and reaches to the cytosol. In the cytosol, the mRNAs undergo translation to produce proteins. These proteins have effects on metabolism, cardiovascular, CNS development, growth and many other systems. These are the enzyme, processes and organelle related to metabolism upon which the thyroxine exerts an increasing effect. These are the process and quantitative data related to cardiovascular upon which thyroxine exerts an increasing effect. Please like, subscribe and share.